Miss Jamie Boyan with the Gray County Courthouse. I am here with uh, Gray County Judge Bill Stout and uh, just held a commissioner's meeting. Um, it, would, it seemed like it was mostly kind of routine stuff. Right? Well, it's, it's the beginning of the new year, October 1st. We had to have a number of contracts in place by October 1st, a lot to do with the insurance, um, with liability and, and, and property and just a number of different insurance we cover, uh, okay. that we get covered with. So that was part, that was most of the agenda today. Um, and then there's mostly routine items. Yeah, right. And uh, uh, I guess, uh, well, it, it's good to know the courthouse was open today. Yes, yes. <laughs> yeah, I, and I did make a comment regarding that. We had a, a little issue on Friday. Um, the um, pipe burst that, that was supplying water to our chillers that cooled the courthouse. And then we found out that it was a circle kind of system that the water that goes to the children also comes through the courthouse first. So we had to shut the water down to the courthouse, which means your, your, your all of your bathroom facilities don't work and your air conditioner's not working. So it makes for a very uncomfortable work environment. So uh, we made the decision because we weren't gonna fix it in a couple hours. It took most of the weekend. We finally got water and everything and the air conditioning working Saturday evening. Um, so. We we, uh, we closed the courthouse a little little before noon on Friday to uh, the employees got an unexpected time off because uh, yeah, right. well, uh, the courthouse gets very very hot very very quickly yeah. if their condition is not working that's and then of course the which water is kind of surprising it's such a big building but I guess that yeah, sun beats on it on takes it. a lot yeah and that and it takes a lot of air to fill this place up and mm -hmm. then then when the water was turned off and all the facilities could be used it just makes for a very uncomfortable work environment, so we just closed that day. Yeah, okay, that makes sense. D did it cause any problems with the jail? No, uh, not. We had the water back on there. We 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 made arrangements for that for that not to take place. So okay, that was all good. Yeah, okay. So it took. Uh, well, it, it's fortunate that it happened, you know, on a Friday instead of yes. in the middle of the yes. week. Yes, yes, it, it picked a good day to go down. If it had to go down, that was a good day. Yeah, yeah, because it was like seven thirty in the morning. I yeah. guess it happened. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. okay. And then everything's normal now. Mm -hmm. We're back to normal. Back to. Now I noticed uh, one other thing uh, that happened uh, in court this morning. You, you kind of had a special prayer. Yes. Yeah. Well, I, I just thought it was uh, it was appropriate for being 9/11 uh, today, the anniversary of the, uh, of the of the twin towers and the attack on our country, and uh, I just thought it was appropriate for us to acknowledge that through prayer. And um, Jay Jackson, a good friend of mine with the United Methodist Church. Uh, came and uh, said a special prayer for us. He and I talked about it last week about doing this, and I just thought it was appropriate because we promised we'd never forget, and I wanted to make sure we did our part. We don't forget. Oh, good deal. And uh, and then I guess there was also a uh, raise in salary approves for the jail nurse practitioner. Yes, yes. I mean, as you've seen over the past year, inflation and cost of, of doing business is going up in every every level of, of the economy scale in terms of whether it be insurance, whether it be labor, whether it be the cost of equipment, whether anything, it's going up. And so um, these practitioners are uh, very, very important to, uh, to the medical health and, and, and requirements that we have to have for the jail operation. And we, we need to review those salaries as well, which we did. Yeah, and it's, uh, you know, because I mean, you guys are still short jailers. Right, least, right. And, and deputies as well. Right. So. So, we had to get closer to the marketplace in terms of what we're paying people to come to work here, and so we're trying to get there. Yeah, okay. Yeah, and you, you have moved forward in mm -hmm. several areas mm -hmm. uh -huh, as mm -hmm. far as that goes. So. Yep, yep. Uh, uh, anything you like to add? No, sir. No, sir. We're just glad the air conditioning and the water's back on. <laughs> just in time. Yes, sir. All right, thanks again, Thank Judge. you. We'll have more later on KLTV 7 News and KLTV.com.